Tonight, all that rain is adding up in parts of the state, especially along the White River near Desark and Georgetown. Corps of Engineers is stepping up to patrol those areas and preparing for potential flooding. THV 11's Brooke Buckner shows us how they do it. We do this just strictly to be prepared for whenever something serious does happen. Kyle Wheeler and the rest of the Corps of Engineers are taking precautions to prepare for any potential flooding. Right now, they're in the first phase of their flood fight plan. It's just more of a, a like a watch phase. During phase one, they patrol the area near the river, inspect the levees, flood walls, and pumping stations. If they keep coming up, then we'll go to phase two activation. And phase two activation is whenever it gets you know a little bit more in depth, and we start doing a whole lot, a lot more frequent patrols. Wheeler says when the flood stage hits 28, they move to phase two. The last phase two activation that we've had was uh, over in our West Memphis area and that was back in 2019. Prairie County Emergency Manager Aaron Booth is also keeping a close eye on the flood stages. Our biggest concern is usually when it gets like 27 or 28 feet that we start to have it on our roads. But this one already is covered. She says if they hit the 30 foot mark, they move to the major flood stage level. Everybody around here kind of errs on the side of caution when it comes to the White River. Including Desarc Mayor Roger Scott. We got backup pumps, two big backup pumps. And they have a new generator just in case flooding does become an issue. You gotta prepare and, and uh, Watch out for your town. Mayor Scott says he expects water levels to go down after this month. We get most of our rain in around here in February, March. But uh, after that, it should go down and go down pretty quick. In Desarc, Brooke Buckner, THV 11 News. Emergency officials say right now the flood stage is currently moderate, sitting just over 26 feet.